If you've ever been to Mackinac City, you know that the Mackinac Bridge is the major iconic attraction for destination seekers. There is perhaps another reason to go that most people are not familiar with. It's called Blue Ice, and it only happens every three to four years. Glacier ice and frozen lakes appear blue, yet icicles and ice from your freezer appear clear. Why is ice blue? The quick answer is because water absorbs other colors of the spectrum, so the one that's reflected back to your eyes is blue. To understand why, you need to understand how light interacts with water and ice. In both its liquid and solid form, water molecules absorb red and yellow light, so the reflected light is blue. The oxygen-hydrogen bonds stretch in response to incoming energy from light, absorbing energy in the red part of the spectrum. Absorbed energy causes water molecules to vibrate, which can lead water to absorb orange, yellow, and green light. Short wavelength blue light and violet light remain. Glacier ice appears more turquoise than blue because hydrogen bonding within ice shifts the absorption, making it more green than liquid water. Snow and ice that contains bubbles, or lots of fractures, appears white because the grains and facets scatter light back toward the viewer rather than allow it to penetrate the water. While clear ice cubes or icicles may be free of the gases that scatter light, they appear colorless rather than blue. Why? It's because the color is too pale a blue for you to register the color. It took a lot of water to produce a noticeable color. The more dense the water molecules or the longer the path through them, the more the red photons are absorbed, leaving light that is mostly blue. Glacial ice starts out as white snow, and as more snow falls, the layers below it become compressed, forming a glacier. Pressure squeezes out the air bubbles and imperfections, forming large ice crystals that permit light transmission. The top layer of a glacier may appear white either from snowfall or from fractures and weathering of the ice. The glacier face may appear white where it's weathered or where light reflects the surface. In effect, ice appears blue because it is blue. 